Russell Morales, Black from TV. Rami, how's it going? It's going great, man. It's going great. We're celebrating. We had a great kickstart in the UK, back in New York, and I uh, can't wait to share this with everyone in America. It's Bond 25. There's been a lot of famous villains in the Bond era. You know, knowing you're playing a role in this movie without going into too many details, how much fun did you have doing this? Well, I had a ton of fun, of course. You step onto those sets and, uh, you know, it's like a, it's dream come true. Childhood dream come true. There's no question about it. And then Daniel's my favorite Bond. So uh, being able to to be part of his last hurrah, celebrate him. And at the same time, yeah, I found it difficult sometimes to want to take him down every day because uh, <laughs> I do have an, an affection for the character and for what he's done. How did you feel seeing a post of yourself part of the Bond franchise? And did you have to play catch up with the previous Bond films? Uh, you know, I, I landed in the UK a few weeks ago or a week ago to do some press. And as soon as I got out of the airport and on the highway or, or into London proper, actually, I saw I saw a picture of myself uh, with a 007 emblem on a double decker bus in London. And I thought, OK, this I mean, I'm still pinching myself at the whole thing. Um, <laughs> it's it's extraordinary. Uh, but you have to. You have to at some point put that aside and say, listen, this is Daniel's final film, working with the guy at the top of his game in, in Daniel and Carrie. And, and of course, this uh, incredible cast we have, uh, um, you got to do him service. You really got to bring your A game every day and make it a difficult experience for him, surprise him. I like that every day is, is kind of keeping, keeping DC on his toes. Uh, mm -hmm. And I think that's the best way to play a villain. Always be feel free, feel liberated and, and surprise them. Mm -hmm. Did you have to play catch up in terms of watching the previous films that Craig had done? Or did you see everything before that? No, I went back. I'd, uh, I'd seen all the Bond films. I, I felt like I'd seen all the Bond films. I went back and picked a few, but uh, I did go back and watch Casino and Quantum, Skyfall, Spectre, just to... Uh, to familiarize myself again with, with what Daniel's been through, uh, through the course of, of his iteration as Bond. And, and uh, yeah, that was helpful because as much as you wanna have uh, some interesting things to do as a villain, the most important thing to do is zero in on your enemy, uh, which for me is James Bond. So I'd, I had to really pay attention to, to those films and, and pick up uh, on his nuances and, and what we, might really need in a final film with Daniel Craig. And I think, think we pulled it off. I think it's a real gut punch. You definitely did. Obviously, this film is exciting. Everybody's been waiting to see it. They're going to have fun with it. I can't see to see what you do next. Wherever you're at, stay safe, and uh, we'll talk down the road. I appreciate it. Look forward to it. Take care.